Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson and getting ready for what should be potentially thrilling action here. It is Malmö up against Bayern Munich. Thanks Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. The line-up then for the hosts. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. Well, here is the Bayern side. Manuel Neuer stands between the posts. Benjamin Pavard plays with Alfonso Davies in the fullback positions. Serge Gnabry starts with Leroy Zane in the wide areas. And leading the line today, Robert Lewandowski. And the game begins. Goretzka, defensive excellence there. In it goes, an early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. The opening goal of the game then. Olsen. Will it happen for them? Ahmed Hodzic. Christiansen. Innocent. Berget. Bonke. Innocent. Well read to put an end to that attack. Lewandowski. On to Goretzka. Beautifully disguised ball. And cleared away. Oh, a lovely ball. Müller. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. Joshua Kimmich with the corner. Cleared away. It's opening up for them. Now with Lewandowski. Oh, he's found the net. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve.
Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. It's going their way, 2-0. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Kimmich. Goretzka has it now. Thomas Müller. Well, potential danger. Both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Possession one. Lewandowski. Müller. Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort. Berget Christiansen well, the attack looks promising innocent A super tackle and they've won possession well as you can see Bayern have had much less of the ball but their attacking play has been really incisive it's been a really good display from them so far and teammates to play it to Sané at the back post and waiting is Thomas Müller. Well, not cleared away completely. And in the end, no damage done. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. Nasty landing on the shoulder for him there and he's in real discomfort. He's a tough boy, I think he'll stay on. Cheers, Jeff. Hunting of players waiting in the middle. He got nothing but ball. He's conceded the corner. Well, what about that opportunity a few minutes ago? We can see it again now. So the corner played into the box. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. And the game begins... Goretzka, defensive excellence there. In it goes, an early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Oh, a lovely ball. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. It's opening up for them. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Lewandowski, Müller. Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort.
Well, off and running again, and still reflecting on a spellbinding first-half performance from Bayern. Will we see more of the same in the second 45? Pavard. And Kimmich. Serge Gnabry. Thomas Müller. And the ball's gone. Ahmed Hodzic. Innocent. Anders Christiansen. Is it going to end up being productive for them? A goal! And it's very much game on here. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why he's upset. He got something on it, but not enough to keep it out. That's frustrating for a keeper. So there we have it, 2-1. Serge Gnabry and Pavard on the ball losing possession here Eric Larson and we're inside the final 30 minutes now Lewandowski carries the ball forward but can he produce from this position? And the decision offside here. Eric Larson, Christiansen, read it magnificently and intercepted. And room now out on the wing. And take it away. He's got space. Crossing opportunity. And an astute piece of defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Not showing good defensive judgment. Rakip. In possession, Ahmed Hodzic. What can they do from here? Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. I think I spoke too soon. Wasn't the best of passes, finally. Pass after pass, happy to just keep possession and frustrate their opponents. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Anders Christiansen. Are still pressing for a goal here. Flag up, tight offside. It's a substitution for Bayern.
Pavard. Lewandowski. On to Goretzka. Alfonso Davies. Leon Goretzka. And here's Joshua Kimmich. It's with Kingsley Coman. Low trajectory ball there. Possession regained by Niklas Zule. Superb. Fine tackle there to prevent a chance. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. Well, he might be young, but he plays with a maturity beyond his years, Leroy Zane. What did you make of what he actually did out there on the pitch? Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for? Goretzka, defensive excellence there. In it goes, an early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Oh, a lovely ball. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. It's opening up for them. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Lewandowski, Müller. Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort. Anders Christiansen. Is it going to end up being productive for them?